What's up guys, Savage Studios here, and today we're doing another toy review. So, we're going to be reviewing this, a little tiny airplane. Now, uh, not much detail, I just got it out of little mystery pack and, ah, ah, ah. what's that? What is it? Uh, oh no! Savage Studio. What do you want? Ah, ah, ah. Pizza the Hut. Yeah, that's me. Anyway, you must review a real toy. That's not a real toy. Review the ones over there. Okay. Good. <laughs> Do it now. Okay, okay, pizza. <laughs> okay, so today, we're going to review something very special. Not our normal stuff, even though this is only the second time we're doing a toy review. I don't even know if we want to take this stuff out of the package. But here we are with... An original Star Wars toy. From long ago. Yeah. A long time ago in a galaxy far, far away. I bought this for a dollar. Well, two dollars, because it was one ninety nine. Star Wars, the Power of the Force series. He got her old Darth Vader on there. And that, that thing right there. Um, Mr. Forlom. Never heard of him. With a blaster pistol and blaster rifle. Okay, so a pistol and a rifle. But we're just gonna call him a. How's it going? Welcome to Star Wars Galaxy. Welcome to Star Wars Galaxy. So today we shall review a royal ugly dude. And also reveal, I mean, review. The original Star Wars Power of the Force Garandan, aka Long Long Snout. We're not gonna call him that. Let's just call him Elephant Nose. Okay, so I got these two for a crazy steal. At Action City, both of these for, well, both of these each, okay, they both cost the same price, okay, I got this one for one, $1 and 99 cents, so $2, and that for the same, so you know what I'm saying, and... Let's just turn these around. Okay, so we got some good going on here. We got, uh, let's go with Royal Ugly Dude first. Um, it's got this here, uh, height 1.6 meters, status bounty hunter, classification. Uh, industrial automation for alarm protocol droid Affli 
affiliation, affiliation, whatever, and freelance, and weapon of choice, p pistol or rifle. We also got other figures. A rebel soldier, Han Solo, in his Endor gear. Greedo. Uh, one of the Sand People. And an ATSD driver. Also those two ships. Now let's take a look at Elephant Nose. Height. 1.85 meters status spy it went blurry oh. Ah. oh well classification Cubas ah now it's working Affiliation and to be to the highest bidder. Weapon of choice, pistol or holdout pistol. You see, you got him on there. Other figures, same old thing. Hmm. So I suppose it's time to take these guys out of the boxes but it, they weren't they were around in can can anyone read that it went blurry again they were around in 1997 I don't want to open them just yet uh, but I suppose, I suppose I should, I mean, they're just, they're just little figures, uh, I don't want to open it, they're too rare, I'm gonna have to, there are other old figures out there, so let's open these things, off camera. Got that one. Got that one. Psych! I didn't get them out yet. I uh, just want to see them just a little bit longer in their glorious package. The packages will be missed. <laughs> Opening off camera. Okay, we will open them on camera. The first damage has been done. Uh, I don't know how we're going to hold this thing. I guess I can hold them this way. Put them on the stand. Uh. Goodbye, glorious package. Now it is your turn. I do not want him to die.
or his package to die. <laughs> Should I really open him, Mr. Royal Ugly Dude? Just see him one more time in his glorious package. Okay, we have opened these beasts, these old beasts, but I gotta say, they look pretty good, and opening them was worth it. So, let's review them, shall we? Okay, so first we're gonna review... Royal, I mean, Elephant Nose. We're gonna review Elephant Nose first. So he came with this little pistol thing. And you see that he's a good figure. Good detail. Nice cape mold back here. He's got like a, some kind of a cloak on. That's pretty cool. Up next is Royal Ugly Dude. Now, you see how his face is extremely ugly. He looks like a he looks like the fly. That that's really gross. But uh, yeah, got like a C three PO armor plating and stuff. Really weird skin some kind of a rifle and another gun these two characters are going to be background characters in the movie so yeah so let's check out the articulation um elephants elephant noses legs move the arm moves his other arm moves. Oh, his head moves. That's good. I thought it was glued on there. That way. Hmm. Alright. Sorry, elephant nose. And, uh... Royal ugly dude. His head moves. Arms move. Legs move. Oh, even the torso. Let me check if they have that on elephant nose. Oh, they do. Hmm. That's good. And it has been a pleasure to open these things out of their package. Right? Uh, I said right? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So you, you agree that it was good to open these Pizza the Hut? Yes, I do. And, uh, I need to quit the habit of eating myself. See, I got the tongue on me. Because I made a pizza. Yeah, yeah, pizza, you kind of are. You kind of are, Pizza the Hut. You are made a pizza. Yeah. Okay, so Pizza the Hut just reviewed them. And I gotta say, they're pretty cool. And they will be background characters slash regular characters in Star Wars Rebel School. So, yeah. These are pretty cool toys. 
uh, it's been a pleasure to review them, and I'll see you on the next upload. The video is over. You hear me? The video is over. So stop it, camera. It's over.